Congratulations, Tatiana. You've, you've qualified for the FIBA World Championship. This month, did it seem possible, you know, two days ago? Well, two days ago, we were trying to get to the, you know, to the quarterfinals here to the, uh, at the European Championship. We didn't even think about the um, World Championship yet. And now, you know, it's, it came true, and this is it. Well, you know, two years ago, you kind of snuck up on everybody and won the bronze medal. Now, you're really close to getting back to the podium. Um, what, how important was your experience in the last two tournaments, the Olympics and the last Eurobasket? Well, uh, you know, we knew that we, we wouldn't be able to sneak in like that, uh, like we did uh, two years ago on anybody, and it happened. Uh, we started not um, very good at the beginning. Uh, but we won the games that we needed to win and of course the experience of the previous European Championship, of the Olympic Games, you know, uh, the just mindset it helped a lot because you you already been in the situation and you know how to behave. Having six people that have been together for six years on this team helps a lot, definitely. Now you were involved there in a crucial play right at the end of the game. You were, you were hemmed in in the corner, I think with the game was tied or you were up by one, but you made a free throw. Tell me about that frantic last minute in overtime. Um, <laughs> you know, coach always puts me in a tough situations in the games. I guess he has this trust in me throughout the years, and you know, I've been proven <laughs> doing well in the critical situations. So, and it happened again, and I don't know. You just your head shuts off, and your body does the you know does does whatever you you know it can, so, and automatically. Well, I, can you celebrate now? Uh, we can relax a little bit, you know, to breathe easily since we know we made it to the final four. But we're not stopping there. Just, just one comment about your point guard, Natalia Marchenka, who broke her nose and has continued to play through pain and made some huge plays today. Yes, uh, well, Natalia has been a turning point in the last three games, you know. Uh, starting not very well at the beginning, you know, a lot of turnovers, you know, she came to the point where she settled down and it's shown this is, you know, the huge part of our success right now. Since she's like the main point guard, you know, she needed, we needed that from her and it, it showed too.